right guys, so what we're going to learn now is how to do an incline dumbbell press. Uh, so it's going to be similar to incline bench press. Uh, and if you have that in your program, you'll see what I mean. There's a couple things I want you to do when you're doing this. One is to retract your scapula. So um, just kind of a fancy saying for squeeze your shoulder blades together, act like you're pinching a great between when you come back. And the reason for that being is to stay tight on a bench. Now, let's pick up the dumbbells and let me show you how to safely pick up dumbbells, okay? So I'm gonna pick up one inch, and then what I'm gonna do is put this on my quad. I'm gonna go to the other side, put this on my other quad. If you cannot pick it up, do not do the weight, all right? I'm gonna repeat, if you can't pick it up, don't do the weight. We want to get our form down uh, first, and then worry about the weight. From here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to retract my scapula. Okay, so I'm pinching that grate between my shoulder blades, and I'm going to kick up the weight to my shoulders, one at a time. Okay, so now I'm tight. If you'll notice, my elbows are at a 45 degree angle. Okay, as opposed to the way people usually bench, which is up here. Okay, you're gonna get some, let me put this down, you're gonna get some chest activation while you're doing that, um, but it, it's also gonna put your shoulders in a vulnerable position. Your shoulders are all, already getting a lot of work in when you're doing chest, so we wanna save our shoulders and at the same time um, work mostly our chest muscle. Start to finish, we're gonna go one leg at a time, okay? Now I'm gonna press straight up, okay? So right in front of my chest, 45 degrees. And if you look, my wrist and my elbows are in line. What I mean by that is my wrist is not in line, if you see that. My wrist is not in line with my elbow. And if I'm going here, my wrist is not in line with my elbow. My wrist is in line with my elbow right here. And I'm going straight up. Go ahead and stand from the side camera. Man. So I'm going to show you side view. Your wrist is too far back. So this is how most people do incline or regular bench press. See how it's going in front of my face? Okay, we don't want to do that. From the side view, coming here and we're going straight up. Just as if we're like pushing someone off of us. Come back over here, to the front please. Again. 45 degree angle, pushing straight up, and back down, controlling both the positive and the negative. That's how we do an incline dumbbell press.